Hello and welcome to the One Verse Devotional. I'm so glad that you're here today. Thank you for joining me here on Phosphorus Project on our devotional. And here at One Verse, it's simple. We look at one verse every day, Monday through Friday, just to help you dive a little bit deeper in your faith. And even though it is January 14th, this is the first week of the devotional. And so we are looking at a few verses that I think can really just set us up for a great 2020. So that's what we're doing this week. Yesterday, we were in the book of Matthew. We looked at Matthew 6.33, where it says, if we seek first God and his kingdom, that all these things would be added to us. I'm like, man, that's a great way to start our year. Well, today we're in the Old Testament, and I would say that today's one verse is almost like a mirror image of that verse out of Matthew. It comes out of the book of Joshua, and we're in the very first chapter. Now, if you don't know who Joshua was, he was the leader of Israel right after Moses. So Moses, one of the greatest biblical figures that we have in the entire Bible, literally, other than Jesus, Moses is my favorite personal Bible character. And so he was amazing. Those would be some huge shoes to fill for Joshua as he becomes the next leader of Israel. And so we have in the very first chapter of the book of Joshua, God is talking to Joshua and he's literally giving him advice on how to lead Israel, how to be a successful leader. I think it would be wise for us, not just for Joshua, but if we look at those words of God and adopt them into our life, because it just wasn't true for Joshua, it can be true for us today as well. And so our one verse today, God is speaking. This is literally in quotes from God, and it's Joshua chapter 1, 8 is our one verse today. And it says, keep this book of the law always on your lips. Meditate on it day and night so that you may be careful to do everything written in it. Then you will be prosperous and successful. If I asked you if you wanted to be prosperous and successful in 2020, you'd be like, yeah, Matt, of course I do. Like, yes, I want to be successful. Well, Joshua 1.8 gives us the key. God says, if we keep this book of the law always on our lips, if we meditate on it day and night, that we will be prosperous and successful. Now I'll say this, God's definition of prosperous and successful is different than man's definition of prosperous and successful. So don't take this as like, hey, read your you know Bible every single day, uh, read the Bible in a year, and God's gonna give you that Ferrari. That's not how it works, all right? That's not happening. However, if you want to be the, the man that God created you to be, if you want to be the woman that God created you to be, if you want to live out that purpose in your life that God has planned for you before you were even born, if you want to live according to the skills, abilities, and gifts that God has given you, that will make you prosperous and successful in the eyes of God. And we have the key here. How can we make that happen in our life? Joshua 1.8, keep this book of the law always on your lips, meditate on it day and night so that you may be careful to do everything in it. And when we follow God's word, when we dive into his word, when we spend time in scripture with God, reading the Bible, spending time in prayer, then you will be prosperous and successful in 2020. That's our key for this year. I think that's a, a great verse to have in January as you're looking at your goals for 2020, as you're planning out what you want this year to look like, I want you to remind you, I wanna challenge you and encourage you to stay in God's word. And if you do, God himself said in Joshua 1.8 that you will be prosperous and successful in this year. Have a great day.